What's going on guys? I know everybody has really been wanting a range update lately. So I uh, stopped by to take a peek at everything and fill you guys in on what's going on. So I'll kind of do a little tour and then at the end I'll tell you about the progress of the project and kind of when we expect to uh, be opening and that kind of thing. So you can see most of this is the retail space in the front is mostly built. We've got uh, this nice wall here. This whole long wall that you see running down this way uh, is going to be our gun cabinet. So, uh, you know, we're always been known for having like everything. And so that is going to continue over here. And we will uh, put everything in this long cabinet. And then there's also some security features and things in it. And uh, so there's our beautiful ceilings. They're going to have nice lights. This will be the big open retail space right here uh, in kind of where this metal is laying down is where uh, a big counter will be. And that's where we'll deal with everybody and check everybody out and that kind of stuff. You can see this is the actual range structure. So this will end up being a workspace uh, for the guys doing the work in the back. And But you can see this is walking into the range. So... This is what it looks like. Those enormous bags you see right there on pallets, those are the rubber that go in the trap to stop the bullets. We got a bad, uh, well, I can't say that. We got a really sweet uh, top of the line bullet trap. You'll be able to fire 50 cal into it and stuff. It's crazy. Um, then you can see all the structure. It's all in and built. Uh, that is actually the steel on the ground right there where they're going to build our baffles. You know, the baffles are the things that stop the bullets from going out of the building, coming back this way. So here's our two bays. That's going to be seven. That's going to be five. Uh, yeah, seven and five. And so we'll be at 12. You'll notice the corner is missing here. So this kind of leads into uh, my talk in a second about when the range is going to open, but this corner is going to be closed in. That wall is going to be shut in and then here's the workspace for the guys and we'll come back out and uh i will talk about the rest of it so where we're at on the project right now um we had a meeting about uh a week ago just to get everybody on the same page uh as to what has to be done in the building and just the way it worked out, you know, we had everybody on that call. And the way it worked out is it's going to be uh, probably about the 1st of May, maybe a little bit earlier. You know, we don't really know how to how to move gun stores around. So I don't know how long it's going to take me to figure out how to get this one open uh, and get everything transitioned where both shops are up and running. Uh, so, yes, we have decided to keep the original Central Plano store as well because uh, we just got so many great customers and we want to you know, make sure that uh, we have more than one vibe going on. You know, this place is uh, probably fancier and nicer than what people are, or definitely fancier than nicer than, well, than what people are looking at in our current shop. Uh, but some people really like the vibe in the current shop. So we're going to have employees in both places that you know the faces will still be familiar. Nothing's going to change. It's just, you know, we have two places to show love instead of one. Um, but like I said, we're looking at about May 1st, uh, you know, I showed you there that the corner was missing, you know, there's numerous things that have to happen in there for people to be able to, uh, bring in equipment and that kind of thing. So a series of events have had to take place in order for us to be able to close that corner. But once that corner is closed here in the next couple of weeks, you know, they're going to really start finishing out the range, which will take about a month. We've got a top of the line, like literally the nicest ventilation system you can possibly get. There's only about one or two places uh, in Dallas that has this quality of ventilation. Uh, you know, you're never breathing your own own smoke or any of that kind of stuff. So anyway, it just takes a little while to get the best stuff in the, you know, in town put in for you. Uh, and then we'll seal everything up, finish it out, make it pretty, put paint on the walls, and it will be ready to go. So uh, we are going to be talking more about membership details and how to get people signed up. We'll have good programs for that. Our memberships, despite us having the nicest range in town, are also going to be the least expensive in town. So if you're looking for a gun range membership, you definitely want to wait until we get them on sale because you're going to be able to save money over anybody else. I mean, we're always known for being, you know, the, the least expensive guys around. So... I look forward to it, guys. We're excited. It's coming along. I know it seems slow. It seems even slower for us, I promise you. Uh, but I can't wait to have the you know best gun range in town here for our Mr. Gun's family and hopefully some new people. 
So share, 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 please let everybody know what's going on. And, uh, you know, we really need your support right now. So thanks a lot guys. And, uh, we'll see you next time.